The PGA Championship is quickly approaching. But there's still lots of work left to make the tournament at Valhalla a success. For more, here's Fred. I was out there this afternoon. Just so much fun just seeing the way it's going. If you had a time lapse thing, I mean, just, it's amazing how fast stuff's going up. Hello again, everybody. We are just 28 days away from the PGA Championship at Valhalla. Normally, it's just one of the USA's best golf courses. But over the next month, it'll also become a temporary city, which will cater to roughly a quarter million people for just a week. For more, here's Natalie Grice in Middletown, Kentucky. Yeah, the best way to describe Valhalla right now is a work in progress. They've got some big things already done, kind of in the middle of some things, and also some big projects that they haven't even started on just yet. A good example of that is the PGA Championship shop right behind me that's going to sell souvenirs to all the fans that come out here to Valhalla. A week ago, the exterior wasn't in place, but now it's up, and they've moved on to working on the interior. Another one of the big structures still in the process of going up is the media center that will house everyone working during the PGA Championship and the media dining tent. Right now, most of the progress is right on pace because the weather has been fantastic. Well, we've been blessed with some great weather the past week. And when you don't have major rainstorms during the eight to five hours, you can get a lot done. We had a uh, a bunch of the venues are nearing completion in terms of the, the skeleton that goes there. So you'll see the, the tent beams and then the covers, the canvas going on top. And once that happens, it's like getting a roof over a house. You can start building the interior of that tent. So a lot of the, the big heavy lifting has been done, and now the, uh, the experts come in to make the insides look like a home. Now, there's one big structure that they really haven't started working on yet, and that's the Wanamaker tent. More than 10,000 tickets will be sold to that area, and right now, it sits as just floorboards. At Valhalla, I'm Natalie Grice, WLKY Sports. Thank you, Natalie. Fascinating to watch. Regular play continues at Valhalla while the temporary city is being built there, but the course will be shut down for the final two weeks before the pros arrive and begin practice on the Monday of tournament week. That's August the 4th, four weeks from today. I am Fred Calgill, WLKY Sports.